this week I'm joined by Antonio Falco, sales and business consultant and also regional chairman of the Federation of Small Business. You know, we go into business because uh, we're passionate about what we do. We're passionate about being the best printer, about being the best web designer, about being the best IT consultant. We're passionate about those things. You're passionate about producing the best possible business programs for, for corporates. That's mm -hmm. what you do. And none of that, nobody ever tells you, but by the way, in order to make that work, you need to start seeing people. In, in the first instance, uh, most people don't understand where they're meant to be starting from. And so the starting point has to be Here's my product or service. Who do I think it's going to appeal to? But there's an understanding of what it is your product can actually do for somebody. I think people are buying confidence. Confidence in the fact that when you say to them, my product or service will, will, will sort this problem out for you, that's what they need to believe. Selling is about trying to understand what the problem is and how you can solve it. Once you do that and you do it properly, you'll make the sale. If you're making a phone call, then the objective of the phone call is what? It's to make an appointment. And I say to people, the starting point is, have six questions ready that you need the answer to that qualifies whether or not in reality you're talking to a prospective customer. Yes, hello, my name is Antonio Falco. I'm a sales and business consultant, and I'm also the regional chairman for Surrey and West Sussex for the FSB. We had a, hopefully an interesting show that you've picked up some tips and hints as to how to maybe improve your business. As it's the 33rd show, I'm going to give three out of three. So let me start with these. In sales, what you need to be doing is one, making sure you understand who you're targeting your product and service to. Two, pick the phone up. Start talking to people. And three, at some point, you need to ask for the order. You're looking to make the transaction. Business. I believe business is about three things. Products, people, and figures. The numbers. When it comes to product, do not compromise on what you're selling. Always deliver the very best that you can. When it comes to people, and last week you heard Steve Bridger talking about communicating, the first person to communicate to is yourself. You need to tell yourself that actually what you're doing is right, you're doing it in a, in a proper manner, with integrity, and that you're looking to help people. And the third thing is numbers. You need to set yourself a target. If you don't aim for something, you won't hit anything. Targets in business is very, very important. And third, let me finish on just in general points, if I may, Steve. Business is about being persistent and consistent. There's no overnight success. This is not Britain's Got Talent, this is serious. It's about making your business work and to do that you have to be persistent and consistent. And you have to have faith. Because if you don't believe in yourself and your business, I can assure you, nobody else is going to either. Have faith in what you do, make it better as you go down the journey, but just do what you need to do.